Hello everyone, Barry Anderson here from Trade Ideas with the trade of the day and a little bit of a different take on the trade of the day, okay? This is PL. So why PL other than the fact that it's uh, moving higher? So, you know, if you come into the room, you know I do a lot of pre-market work and about um, 9 o'clock is when I get on the mic and we start talking about the stocks that are moving and all. And the other thing I do is I take a look at the upgrades and downgrades. That's around 9.10, that's when I get them in my email. So one of the upgrades, or one of the ones I saw was this PL. So why PL and why would it be of interest to me? So first of all, I, look, I know everybody wants to dump on Goldman Sachs and I'm not saying, you know, it's not merited or anything like that. But Goldman Sachs, they initiated coverage uh, of this one, PL, and they put an $11 price target on it. Now, you can be, we can be skeptical. We can think, okay, maybe they've got a bunch of their customers already in it and they're trying to offload. It doesn't really matter. Um, all I do is watch to see how it trades, okay? So um, there it was, PL. It was holding six pretty, pretty well. At one point, it, did, it, it got right to six. And then in this move here, I thought, you know what? This looks like it's going to hold. So I got into this one just under 620 and I have actually held throughout, okay? And there's a part of me that depending how this closes, I may swing it. I mean, you know, the, it, it's got some resistance around the 720 level, but I might, I might swing it depending on how it closes. Uh, almost for sure I'll take some off though to, to lock in some gain and maybe hold a bit to swing. But I thought I would just point this one out because yes, sometimes the news does matter. And yes, I know it came from Goldman Sachs, but hey, it obviously, it, it's the only thing I can see, uh, the only reason I can see that it moved this one. And uh, so far, so good. And with an $11 price target, I mean, I'm not saying it's gonna to get to $11, but um, you know, it's a fairly high float. Uh, I think 170 million in the float. So, you know, it shouldn't be too whippy, but we'll see what happens uh, going forward. So I thought I'd bring that to your attention and I'm entitling this one. Sometimes, yes, the news does matter. All right, I wanna get back into our trading room. So in the email you're getting, you will still see a um, promo code for 20% off, MLK20. Uh, for 20% off So take advantage of that if you want to take out a subscription to trade ideas and I'll open the room tomorrow at 8 o'clock Eastern time I hope to see you then. Bye. Bye